Hi everyone, this is New Times Hair. Today we're going to talk to you about one of the fundamental aspects of making a hair system, ventilation. There are nine ventilation methods in the hair industry and they are as follows. Single reverse split knots, double reverse split knots, single flat knots, double flat knots, V-looped hair, normal injected hair, lift injected hair, double silk top and single silk top. Each method has its own characteristics and can give you a particular look to your hair. We need to be careful about which ventilation you, method you use and where because it could have an overall negative effect on the look of your hair system. At New Times Hair, we have a team of professional sales representatives who can help and assist you on any matter and this includes with product design or business development. We also guarantee the high quality of all our products and what you order is what you'll get. In this video, we're going to show you how to make single flat knots and double flat knots, as well as talking about the individual characteristics and the type of appearance they can give to your hair system. Okay, first of all, let's talk about how to make single flat knots. You can see that single flat knots are very small. You can also see that the hair of these kind of knots lays tightly on the base. Because the hair is very flat, we normally apply this kind of hair to the back and to the sides. Because here we want the hair to lay flat and not point in an upwards direction so that it can mix well with the real hair of the wearer. Now we're going to show you how to make a single flat knot with the following props to help you understand the process more clearly. You can see that the two strands of hair stay very closely together and that the hair lays flat down on the base. It also can easily change its direction as you can see here. Okay, once again, but this time with real hair. Okay, let's move on to double flat knots now. You can see that double flat knots are much bigger. They're therefore stronger. And if you look at the two strands of hair from each of the knots, stay very closely together and they also lay down close to the base, which gives a flat look to the hair. So that's why people choose double flat knots all over. There are two reasons for that which I've just touched upon. One is that they are strong knots and two is that it leaves you with a flat hair look and the hair will stay flat. You need to be aware, however, that many base materials can't support double flat knots. Swiss lace, for example, and transparent skin, they can't support double flat knots. Skin with gauze can, this is one material that can support double flat knots. If you try and use double flat knots on materials that are too weak, they will just break when you are ventilating the knots. Now let's show you how to make a double flat knot with the following training prop. Okay, let's do it again, but this time with real hair. Here we have double flat knots. You can see they're bigger, they're stronger, flatter. Single reverse split knots and double reverse split knots are also popular in the toupee industry. But how are they different and what kind of appearance can they give? If you want to know more about them, then check out the link in the short description of this video. And as we said at the beginning of this video, there are more than just four ventilation methods. So subscribe to our New Times Hair YouTube channel and look out for other videos on ventilation methods.